Hello friends, my name is Raza Masood. Today we shall discuss about a very interesting topic that what is the difference between authentication and authorization. Friend, uh, both these two topics are very important and uh, in the software industry uh, these two topics are, are used uh, interchangeably. So first of all we must have to understand that what is the difference between these two terms authentication and authorization. So let's uh, start first of all I would request to please subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell option as well so that my new videos can reach to you. So let's uh, start friend. First of all we have to understand that what is authentication. Friend, authentication is the act of validating that the users are whom they claim to be. This is the first step in any security process. What does it mean basically? For example, uh, for example, you are um, uh, you are on a website uh, or some administration website and you have to enter the user ID and password for example. So the pass username and passwords are the most common authentication factor. If a user enters the correct data, the system assumes the identity is valid and grants the access. One time password or OTP. This is another type of uh, authentication grant access for only one session or transaction. OTP normally used at the time of transaction like for example if you are doing the transactions through the mobile apps or the internet banking portal. Authentication apps generate security codes via an outside, outside party that grants access. Biometric authentication that means a user presents a fingerprint or eye scan to gain access to the system. So these are the very common example of authentication. Now authorization. Authorization means uh, authorization in a system security is the process of giving the user permission to access a specific resource or function. This term often used interchangeably with access control or client privilege. In secure uh, environments authorization must always follow authentication. Users should first prove that their author identities are genuine before an organization administration grant them access to the requested resources. So uh, friend authentication means that uh, you are claiming you are proving that what you are so you are proving like from uh, the user ID or password and authorization means that once you have proved that, that you are the right person then the uh, right privileges uh, the appropriate pr privileges and access would be granted to you. Now we can discuss that what is the difference between authorization and authentication. Friend authentication means that in the form of a key uh, the lock on the door only grant access to someone with the correct key is in much the same way that a system only grants access to users who have the control correct credentials. This is the authentication. The authentication means that for example if you have the key so you can enter. Now author authorization. Authorization in the form of permissions basically. Once inside the person has the authorization to access the kitchen and open the cupboard that holds the pet food. The person may not have permission to go into the bedroom for a quick nap. Are you getting my point? This is, this is the difference between authentication and authorization. Authentication if you have the key you can enter into the house. But authorization means that you can only go into the kitchen and you cannot go into the bedroom. So that is the uh, main difference between authentication and authorization. Authentication means that you can get the access. Authorization means that you get the appropriate privilege or access uh, appropriate authorization appro appropriate privileges okay so that is the main difference between authentic author authentication and authorization so friend thank you thanks a lot for watching the video i hope uh, you like this video if you like please share it with your friends and colleagues and thanks for watching the video thank you